And while it's still very early in the season, the top teams, Greg, have already started to distinguish themselves across the NBA. Getting off to a hot start, always a good sign. But, but don't sleep on the teams that are still getting locked in. A lot can change in the coming months. Now let's take a look at Denver's opening lineup. Gordon steps in at the four with Jokic in at center. Jamal Murray is out there with MP. Five on the clock. And that one's good. Good selfishness. Always admirable in a basketball player. And Covington consistent in giving it up when one of his teammates is open. Some nice ball movement by the Nuggets. And the foul called out also Westbrook. That is his first foul of the game. First personal foul. First team foul. And here are the Nuggets now. Murray kicks to MP. Gets up a three. He gets it to go Number from 18. beyond the arc. Here's Westbrook. His last outing, he had 24 points. Outside, George. And the foul, foul. called on MP. Number that 18. is his first foul of the game. First personal foul. First team foul. About one minute into the first quarter. Now here's Paul. He's guarded closely. Six on the shot clock. Zubats against Jokic. Fantastic defensive instincts. Encouraging signs of progress from Jokic. First quarter of play with about a minute and a half gone. It's good. Number 18. MP's got five points so far. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Now, here's Covington. Looking at his numbers, he's averaging about uh, six and a half points a game. To the middle. Zubox, that's good. Uh, Robert Covington is a decent passer. His position and has a good feel for when to share the ball. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Well, Teron Lou and I had a few minutes to share. He's looking for his guys to put up a terrific performance tonight, especially at the defensive end. He said, we want to use our length and athleticism to protect the rim, make it hard for shooters to get clean looks. This is the first meeting of the season between these two. Guys, we'll see how it comes out. All right, D.A., we appreciate it. We're focused on defense, Greg. We'll see how it plays out. Huh? It's going to come down to hustle. And in this league, you have to be very quick to rotate when you're in health. And that's why communication is so important. Guys have to talk to each other on the defensive end. I heard a coach once say that talking is energy, and energy is execution. The Nuggets shooting their first free throw of the night. And, and as a unit, they're shooting 78% from the line. That's a solid number to work with on the season. And this year, they haven't quite been able to maintain the free throw percentage they had last season. For the Clippers organization, GA, what do you think the goal is? Well, it, it's clear to me, Kevin, get to the NBA Finals. The Clippers have never made it there. I think a trip to the Finals is within reach of this group. They just need to stay healthy. Jokic passes to MP from deep three-point range. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. Here's Hyman. 12 points his last outing. George with no one around. And again, it's the Clippers missing. And pushing it up, here's Denver. Murray, the pass to Jokic. Good, and the assist goes to Murray. Jokic has got his second bucket. They've wasted no time settling into their offense. Yeah, they're lasered in. I mean, really making the most of their possession. Now here's Paul. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet for him. Here's George. And that time, also a missed shot. Boy, just not scoring with the efficiency he'd like to. Tough quarter for him. Here's Gordon. Jokic trying to free himself up. And the basket by Gordon. Yeah, they're going to have a nice run here. Clippers trail by 10. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, their offense has ground to a standstill. And 
stolen by MP. And Jokic gets it to go with the assist by MP. Jokic just got his third basket of the night right there. So timeout called here, the first for Los Angeles. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, and you know, that's going to be the focus of this timeout. They need to come up with a spark to get the offense going. A different look for the... The whole new lineup now. Paul George is out there with Russell Westbrook. Then it's Ivica Zubac. Then there's Norman Powell. And it's Covington in at the four. So that's the lineup on the floor for the Clippers. Now here's MP. Last game with 34. Count it. Good. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. You know, the defense has really been kept off balance because of the outstanding passes. Four straight field goals have been made off an assist. They have been board dominant in this game. That's definitely been a factor in crafting this huge lead. And it's been a well-rounded performance. I mean, strong rebounding has certainly been at, been at, the, at the center of it, Aaron but it's been good on a number of levels. How about the purpose with which he's crashing the backboards right now? Some hard-earned second-chance points. With a short break in the action, gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Thanks very much. In recent years, the NBA has opened several international academies. Commissioner Adam Silver says huge numbers of people are playing basketball, but unless you take the best at a young age, get them facing elite competition and training under high-pressure circumstances, they won't develop into NBA caliber players. Kevin? Well, opening doors, David, that's always a good thing. Expansion. Thank you. And here's MP for three. Two minutes. That's in there. Number Murray 18. with the assist. Three point basket. Murray's got three assists in the game. Westbrook kicks to Powell. 144 left in the first half. Here's Covington. And different foul. games, Denver. different officials. Nicole Something Denver. that might be called a foul in one game break may not be called in the next. Foul. As a player, uh, how do you adjust to that? Yeah, that's a great question, and that's part of being a veteran. I learned early on you actually shots. scout officials the same way you scout the players. They have tendencies as well. Boy, he's an outstanding defender and a very capable shooter. Covington is an extremely valuable role player. And here's MP for three. Offensive rebound. Bucket is good. Aaron Gordon's got four points in the quarter. How frustrating for the defense. You get the stop, but then fail to block out. Well, you know, that's the way it's going to be for them today, fellas. Can't sustain any momentum. Now here's Covington. Five points in the game. The three from George. It's held in by Jokic and a big lead for them on both the scoreboard and the backboard thus far. Yeah, rebounding Jamal has been Murray. a big key in this one. They've asserted their will and have taken control on the glass. So here's Westbrook following the score by Jamal Murray. Back to Westbrook. 43 seconds left now here in the second. George, no good. I'm not sure why he keeps trying his luck from deep here. It's just not his night. Dishes to MP. Tries a three. Six for ten with that shot going in. That's a good game for a lot of guys. Oh, great ball movement there. And it's Westbrook with the ball. He brings it up for Los Angeles. Covington passes to Powell. Outside Westbrook. Passes to Covington. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. And they call an illegal screen. Here. Illegal screen and not Angeles. the most common call ball. That you'll see in the NBA. But the the game, that pick wasn't illegal. Yeah, you know, the officials aren't nearly as lean. And the first half is now in the books. Time now for the halftime with, break. Score. with the third quarter Your soon quarter. to follow. Right here on 2K Sports. The Nuggets. 48. Please give a big round of applause for your Clippers Youth Dance Team. Fans, your Clippers Youth Dance Team. And after a very lot.
lopsided first half. We'll see if things play out a little more evenly here in the second. You look at MP in this game, guys, he has been everywhere. Yeah, he's just been raining down on him from deep here. Talk about dialed in. Well, you know, the stroke looks fantastic. Even when he's had a hand in his face, it hasn't affected him at all. Second half is underway. Here's who Michael Malone's got on the floor. Gordon steps in at the fourth with Jokic in at center. MP is out there with Jamal Murray. George, no good. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if he gets yanked soon. I mean, that's how bad his shot selection has been. Hey, Clark, one stat where Jokic is consistently Whoa. dominant, of course, is rebound. Well, he does everything well, but you're right. Season after season, game after game, Kevin, he is eating that glass. He stays near the top of that particular statistic. And he knows games are won and lost on the boards, and he wants to be able to contribute in that way. But he is a brilliant, brilliant player, not just a rebound. The shot by Powell, no good. The shot's there for him, and he's got to take it. I, I don't care if he doesn't convert. That's a shot he has to continue to take. Murray with the bounce pass. And here's MP for three. Here's Jokic. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the contact. Too big, too skilled. Jokic just methodically breaks you down. He's a very unique player. For Denver, they go on two for three at the foul line this game. First free throw is good. So for the Clippers, Morris is checked in for Robert Covington. Gordon comes in for Norman Powell. Mann subbed in for Russell Westbrook. And a switcher also for Denver. Caldwell Pope's checked in. And Jokic drops them both. Not sure if anybody has a better feel for the game than the man standing at the line. Jokic in elite company in that respect. Pass to Mann. Taking a switch board. here. MVs checked in. Nuggets have gone 7 of 15 from the field here in the third quarter. Fires for three. Good, and the Number assist 18. goes to Murray. Three pointer. Murray's got five assists tonight. Boy, slick pass by Murray. He makes such an effort to create for his teammates. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Two seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Westbrook against Murray. Just five on the clock. And it's sent back by Jokic. Jokic has the size necessary to deny shots, and it helps when he's engaged on the That's defensive end. The end. The and so the is score. Denver able to put on a show for the Eagles. They've been playing some inspired defense, giving up very few easy points. We come back right after this. And a moment now as we take a look at our State Farm assists of the game. And the winner today, the big fella here with the sweetest of dimes. What a plus it is to have a post player who's got this ability to find. Boy, that's a nice asset to have. It's a huge boost to any offense, too. It adds a whole nother dimension when you've got a big guy that can pass. And we reach the fourth quarter in a game that may be already out of hand. So with George on the bench, here's who Teron Lou's going with. Morris is out there with the two. And it's Boston in at the three, the small four. You know, Batum is not just a score. He's a really good all-around player. Very effective at finding the open man, too. And here's MP for three. That counts. He's put up 13 shots, and he's had eight of those go in. And those aren't the type of three-point opportunities that you can allow in the NBA. You're exactly right. I mean, those come back to bite you every time, just like it's biting them now. The Nuggets shooting around 60% on the night. Amazing work offensively so far. From deep. 
The Clippers grab the miss. One minute now into this fourth quarter. Morris outside. The tray. Chanchar grabs the miss. And I thought that was going to drop. It looked good from here. MP outside. From deep. Hands it from downtown. MP's got a couple of three-pointers now in the fourth for the Nuggets. And perimeter score key. I have to imagine it was a topic of discussion at halftime. Certainly. I mean, they saw a weakness in the perimeter defense and took advantage of it. How about three points from long range just going at each other? Looks to me like there could be something personal taking place here. MP, that's for two. And it's Denver scoring again. Assisted. And that's just cold it right there. He's taking no prisoners. Guys, when you're this hot, it's elementary. Let it fly. Keep staying at it. Here's Boston. Here's Preston. And it's MP with the rebound. And if you ask me what percentage of the time he's making that shot, my answer would be in the single digits. Well, you can't be forcing a shot like that. You got to keep the ball moving. Get something better. Let's it go from deep. Morris with the rebound. And Morris has got the ball here for Los Angeles. Here's Preston. Pass to Morris. And Morris throws it down. Marcus Morris just Senior. aggressive Two. there. Instead of going to one of his patented shots inside, Morris just simply rises up to be free. There's the pass to Chancho. Now here's MP. Puts up a three. A three-pointer is right on target. MP's got 30. So many of the plays they're running designed to create opportunities from the game. game. Yeah, that's exactly their plan here in the fourth. Work to find space behind the arc and then bury some threes. Here's Preston. No good. And we're about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter. And here's MP for three. Number Another three for Denver. Three point basket. And this is the game plan for him. He's a big part of their floor spacing. And you know what? It's all about the long distance game for him tonight. He's getting it done from out there. Here's Boston. Kept alive. Morris. Missed inside. Boy, that's a look. He has to finish, and he knows it. Lone opportunity. Well, guys, this was never really a contest. Just a total obliteration, if you will. And you can safely say mission accomplished now for the Nuggets. As one-sided as it gets today, you know, there were some dominant moments in there about every facet of this game for that team. Yeah, I mean, Kevin, it's hard to think of what didn't go right for them. Uh, game planning by the coaches, execution by the players, everything was just on target. And so they'll oh, stretch their victory right. total to 19 Deep on the nine. season. They can first, chalk first this one up, foul. but these two teams first will see plenty more of one another before the season. The line for your window. And so it's Denver taking care of business in this one. This one was over well before the final buzzer. The fans we were waiting for, for something to get to excited about Greg, but they never got it. They sure did. I mean, they just this win. win. They made it look really easy. What an efficient performance at both ends. And that about wraps it up. For Clark Kellogg, Greg Anthony, and David Alders, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports. And we'll see you next time.